Okay, so before we actually get into playing this groove, I just want to quickly go over how we should be counting this out and the way we're going to be subdividing. So there's going to be a chord note pulse. One, two, three, four. But we are actually going to be playing 30 second notes. So that means each quarter note is going to get eight little subdivisions. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. 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 With that in mind, I think it'll help you understand a little bit more about the placement of each note within the groove. So this groove is largely based on what's happening between my kick drum and my hi-hat. And there are a lot of single pedal doubles. So if that's not comfortable for you, I recommend starting by just practicing to a click and playing doubles between your kick and your hi-hat. speeding that up until it is comfortable. Then the groove will be a lot easier for you. So as I already mentioned, we're going to be playing eight notes or eight little subdivisions per corner note. So I'm going to play through each one of those eight note groupings and that'll allow you to hear what they sound like on their own and then we'll put it all together. So the first part of the groove sounds like this. And then we're going to add the second chunk, which will actually repeat itself again later in the groove. And that sounds like this. Okay, and the third chunk. And then, like I said, we're going to come right back to what we played for the second part of the groove. All together. And that's it. I'm also going to include a transcription that I made with Mike Johnston's Groove Scribe app, and I'm going to put that in the description below the video if you want to see the actual notation. But I would love to see you guys give this a shot. I hope it answered your questions about the groove, and thank you so much for watching.